frequently called waxy or goaty, caprylic acid is mostly formed as beer ages. In complex beers like barley wines, caprylic acid may be harder to identify than in beers with light flavor and aroma characteristics. This is one reason why full-flavored beers are more capable of standing up to aging than conventional beers. Fatty acids are produced by yeast during lipid synthesis and are released into beer as yeast ages. As yeast is stored in beer, it will lose vitality and the cell membrane permeability will increase. This will result in release of short-chain fatty acids into beer. This will be followed by cell death and further release of fatty acids. Higher temperatures will accelerate cell deterioration and death, eventually leading to production of this compound. Lipids from malt can also contribute to fatty acid formation if they've been carried into wort in the form of break from the whirlpool. Brewers should minimize the time the yeast is stored on beer at the end of fermentation through maturation. Store the beer at cold temperatures and monitor the amount of break or trube carried over from the whirlpool to make sure wort has a low level of solids.